Welcome back, everyone. My next guest is Jason Wasser, and he is the owner of Chocolat Toll. If I said it correctly, guys, you got to listen up. This is awesome. Welcome to the show. Tell everybody a little bit, a little bit about what you do. So I'm an artisanal chocolatier. Basically, what we do is my company creates artisanal chocolates, which is we create chocolate-based confections using a wide variety of fresh fruits, herbs, high-end liqueurs, um, and a variety of different spices to create exotic um, and incredibly delicious confections. But on top of that, we also use colored cocoa butter where we hand paint each individual chocolate, which really gives it that, that vibrant, eye-catching color that really makes people say, wow, when they open the box. i got to tell you, when we opened up the box here before we started, what did I do? I went, wow, these are absolutely gorgeous. So you are right that, you know, someone does need to see these. You've got a, a website, and I'm going to get it out right away, uh, which is, and let's just say it, is it Chocolat Toll, but let's, you have to know how to uh, spell it, so that's why I'm going to spell it out for everybody. It's X-O-C-O-L-A-T-L. Confections with an S dot com. Now, I want everybody to check out this website because you're not going to believe what you see when you see them, and when you see them in person, they're even more beautiful. Okay, uh, real quickly, I just want to know how you got started in this. Well, I got introduced to chocolates like this from living in Europe. My dad was stationed in Kaiserslautern, and I mean, my brother grew up eating a lot of European confections, and I always tended to favor those style of candies over the American style. Um, and I didn't realize, you know, back 20 years ago, they weren't making chocolates like this just yet. Uh, I got introduced to this about eight years ago when a friend of mine was graduating from college. I thought, I need to get her a gift. I want it to be something that is unique and different. And so I went online, and the first thing I did is I Googled European confections. And a lot has changed since then. The evolution of the chocolate industry has changed, and people have learned new techniques. And I was amazed at the versatility that chocolate had. Uh, and the artistry that you can do with it. And so that's really what got me hooked on this business. Uh, and ever since then, I, I started off as just a hobby, you know, person just trying to do this as a hobby. Uh, I was in school in the GI Bill, you know, I was in school for molecular biology. I picked this up as a hobby and I applied my biochemistry background to creating these confections. And six years later, this is where we are. And, they're phenomenal. Here's what we're going to do. First of all, I'm going to let you start to describe some of them. Okay. Okay. I'm also going to open up the lines of the audience for everybody to get entered in to win one box. And the box is really relatively inexpensive. It's only $40, which when you see them, you will realize that they, each one really worth, is worth it. I mean, I look at this, and they almost look like... Um, they, they look like stones, they look like uh, gifts, they look like they're precious. Um, uh, how do I explain that? Well, some but people would say they look too pretty to eat. They are. They are. We can promise you they, they taste too good not to. And I'm sure they are. Now, uh, we're going to open up the lines to the audience. Everybody's going to get entered into win a box of these chocolates. Uh, a number is 602-277-5369. Toll free, it's 1-866-536-1100. What is your number one... I mean, obviously, when you sell a box of chocolates, they're buying the whole box, and there's how many in here? What, like 12? We have 18 individual 18. flavors, mm -hmm. uh, which change in the summertime. We create new flavors. That's when we you know, get our creative juices going, and we start developing new ideas and new concepts. And we spend the entire summer during our slow season coming up with four or five new flavors that we'll introduce uh, in, in, the, in the fall time. When they purchase these online, mm -hmm. or they can go to a store, and you can talk a little bit about that, um, can they choose which ones they want in the box, or is it basically this, the, what you have is what you get? So online, you can get a, a nine-piece box if they want, which is a random assortment. So we don't have the website set up yet for you to choose which ones you want. Now, okay. if you get the, the large box, the 18-piece box, that comes with one of everything. So that's, that's kind of You're going to want one of everything. I'm sorry to tell you that, guys, but go ahead. That's, that's the box for people who are a little indecisive. Um, now, if you go to the shop that we have on 7th Street and Oak, there you can pick and choose which flavors you want to go into your boxes. And that is also on the website. It, and, but where is it um, that, you, that they can go, that they can, uh, go so to pick out their own? It's at the Artisan Food Guild Community Market. That is um, at 7th Street and Oak between McDowell and Thomas. Um, and that's open Monday through Friday, 9 to 9. 
and then it's also up on Saturday from 9 to 4. The website again, and I'm just going to spell it out for you. It is X-O-C-O-L-A-T-L, confections with an S, dot com. You can also call them. Their phone number is 602-885-4673. This is a gift that when you give this gift, they're going to love it. They're just going to love it, and they're going to remember you forever. Okay, let's go ahead and start describing some of them. All right, so one of our new ones is the Rio, and all these chocolates are inspired from either experiences that we've had with other cultures or from uh, cookbooks from different parts of the world. The whole idea, the whole philosophy behind our confections is to try to take all the cultures of the world and bring it together in one box. So the Rio was inspired. Um, I was at a jiu-jitsu tournament about five years ago, and there was a Brazilian uh, company up there selling these acai bowls. Um, and so basically, I remember how good those were, and the first thing that came to my mind is, how can I turn that into a chocolate? And so this chocolate is basically a two-layer chocolate. The top layer is an acai berry pate de fruit, and the bottom layer is a white and milk chocolate blended ganache that has coconut puree and a banana liqueur. Wow. <laughs> Go ahead. Uh, so our most popular one is our Bananas Foster. And that's made exactly the same way and the same style that you can see it made at Brennan's in Louisiana. So we take uh, butter and brown sugar and turn that into a sauce, and then we add chopped bananas and a Bermudan rum, and we flambe that all together. That gets pureed and put into a white chocolate. That's all combined, and that we pipe that into the shell, the, the white chocolate shell. I want to try one. My mouth is starting to water here. Come on, what the, which one should I try? The raspberry one? Uh, our most one? popular one would either be the raspberry or the creme brulee. Oh, where's the creme brulee? The creme brulee is this one right I'm here. I'm going with the creme brulee, one of my favorites. And so that is also a white chocolate ganache. And basically, we create it the same way that you would make creme brulee. We take egg yolk, whipped in with sugar, and then we pour boiling cream into that with uh, uh, Madagascar vanilla bean. And that gets folded into the white chalk, and we pipe that into the shell, and it tastes just like creme brulee. It looks, it, you have to also explain, first of all, too, that they're shiny, they're, mm -hmm. they're beautiful. They're, each one is a work of art. They're absolutely phenomenal. I'm going to try it. Go ahead and talk right. while I'm doing this. The color and the shine comes from the natural oils in the mm -hmm. cacao bean. Oh, so we I separate think. we separate the oil from the cacao bean from the dry matter, and when when it's in its melted state, it's kind of like melted butter. So, mm -hmm. but it's a little bit more clear. And you so can good. Add coloration to that, and then from there we can use a variety of different things like a pastry airbrush or paint brushes, and we just paint the molds that way. Um, and when it when chocolate is allowed to go from a liquid to a solid on a shiny surface, it'll become shiny as well. So we just make sure that we polish the molds, we airbrush the molds, we coat them with chocolate, empty them out, and then we have a nice hollow cavity to put the flavoring into, and then we cap those off, and once they come out, they're colorful, they're shiny. They're not too sweet? Nope. Perfect. I just tasted the creme brulee, and it was phenomenal. Well, and that's part of the model of how we make our chocolates. It's more of that European style. I, I developed that palette when I was younger, where we focus less on flavor overload and sugar overload, we focus more on balance between the chocolate and then the variety of flavors that we add to it. All right, their website again is X-O-C-O-L-A-T-L, confections with an S, dot com. You can also call them. Their number is 602-885-4673. You want to give a gift to somebody that they'll remember you for the rest of your life. They're going to love you for them. We're going to let you call in for the, throughout the rest of the show for these. Again, everybody's getting entered in to win one box. There, it's a $40 value, free to you or just somebody really special. Again, our number here is 602-277-5369, and toll-free it's 1-866-536-1100. What are some of your final words for today? Um, well, Go ahead with some of the d different flavors. Go uh, ahead. Well, the, another new one that we created was the Crema de Limon, which is a uh, white chocolate ganache that has mascarpone and lemon zest uh, with a little bit of lemon juice. My personal favorite is a cherry kirsch. It's a layer of Morello cherry pate de fruit on top of a dark chocolate ganache with a German kirsch. Uh, and then our other big one, uh, it's, a, it's a big seller everywhere we go, is our dark chocolate with the Macallan 12-year scotch. Wow, I was just looking at that one. Say it again, what is it? The, the, the single malt scotch one? Right. Yeah, that's a 70% dark chocolate ganache uh, of a Venezuelan varietal with the Macallan 12-year. 
not only are they scrumptious, they're delicious, they're beautiful. What a wonderful gift to give to somebody, whether it's for the holidays or just someone's birthday or just somebody special that you want to give. This gift is just phenomenal. Again, check them out on their website. It is X-O-C-O-L-A-T-L confections with an s.com their phone number is 602-885-4673 or call here get entered in to win one of these beautiful boxes of chocolate 602-277-5369